We acted faster than a lot of the people. Um, and I think we did um, far more, I think we were far more effective in our resource allocation. Um, plus I think we acted in some markets on real estate much faster than some of the others. Um, but I will also say that most of our clients actually um, either kept their budgets constant or expanded our services by using marketing services to boost the communication. We are seeing growth. First of all, two of the biggest economies continue to grow. China and India are continuing to grow. Right? With the export taking place in China this year, the Chinese economy will get a further boost. Uh, the Indian economy is continuing to grow. We're seeing big growth coming in Indonesia, in Vietnam. In, in election year, which is now in the Philippines, we're seeing growth because of the elections. The markets that are slightly reacting slightly slower than the rest are Australia and um, Japan. Uh, but you know, if, if we're in Hong Kong, and if you look at real estate as a barometer, then the prices in Hong Kong seem to have come back, or at least are on their way back up. The big learning that came out of last year was that clients now more and more are seeking integrated communications and they're seeking people who can seamlessly deliver it. And given our structure, I think we were in a good place to deliver that between Gray and G2. I think the big difference that's happened is that the sentiment has changed a lot. I think last year at this point in time, a lot of people uh, were going to lose jobs and lost jobs. I think, and you know, I, I think there was a lot of that that sort of taking place where you know people were going to lose jobs. You know, when will you get a pink slip? And therefore, there was a lot of sort of people hanging on. I think it's fair to say that most companies have restructured, have reorganized themselves. So I think people who are you know working currently, I think they believe that you know the worst is over, um, and there has been some pent up demand, and we're seeing some of that coming into this year. Um, so I'm, you know, I'm cautiously optimistic that this year will be a good year.